So we're going to go in here and buy some stuff to help me clean Dusty. Yeah. Right. Degreaser, rags, brushes for brushing the dust, wipes, gloves, stuff for cleaning Dusty. But they didn't have any Imperial socket sets. So we've now got to go to another shop in Honiton. Okay. Thanks cameraman, person. So today is the day I've got some free help from my old friend Nick to try and get the plane ready for its last day of annual. So we're putting lots of stuff back together, taking some more stuff off. Got to take off the uh, canard mounting brackets so that we can get to the nose oleo to regas the nose strut. And put lots of stuff back to the, put the interior back in. I thought my friend would bring his tools today and he hasn't. Uh, so first stop is to try and go and buy a set of Imperial tools because on American airplanes there ain't no metric. Ain't no metric bolts or screws or anything. So trying to find some uh, Imperial socket and spanner sets. Uh, and today's probably the day that I'm going to be investing in a proper set of tools so I can do basic maintenance on my aircraft myself. Let's see how that goes. It really is time for me to learn what tools I need. I feel like a kid going to the shops with his dad because I've got to go and get a whole set of parts. I mean, tools. And I literally don't know what to get. <laughs> it's pathetic, isn't it? But I intend to change that. And my friend Nick is a sort of weird mechanical genius who, since we were children, has been able to fix things just really weirdly just fix stuff that wasn't working. Even when we were kids on a farm, driving a clapped out old Land Rover that used to break, he'd figure out a way to fix it every time. It's like a, like a sort of bizarre sixth sense he has with machines. Um, and he's got a, a lifelong tool set built up. And I need to begin mine, but he quite rightly pointed out that I need to have one for in the plane, so that if I have a small issue while I'm away, I've got a, a toolkit in the plane do basic things and maybe change the spark plug in the engine uh, or fix something in the battery but then I'd like to have a full tool set in the hangar so I can do slightly more advanced stuff on my own and a spanner set so Um, it's, it's a handy thing to have for yeah. levering stuff. Locking class, is that the proper name for a long river? Yeah. Never heard that before, I've done it. And you said you've got pliers and you've got needles. Yes. Hopefully you wouldn't need a tank saw too often. <laughs> Are you part? So in order to just regas the nose earlier, this entire assembly's got to come out because of this bar that goes all the way through there. But annoyingly on the other side, this bar has got this attached to it that goes all the way up to here into the elevator control. Um, so all of that's got to come out just to, to regas the strut and make sure we gas it right up. So in all of these, Nooks and crannies. Can you see that down in that one there? Yeah. It's just gunk. It's got a, has it got a brush attachment? It has. Uh, no, it hasn't got a brush attachment. I've got a brush. I've got, I've got a nozzle. Ooh, it smells like an aviation museum. Oh, foam cleaner for this stuff, like in the car wash days. Mm. Um, oh, I do regret doing that. You warned me about it. Did I? I remember you saying, this is one way ticket. You're on the magic carpet? Yeah. 
Ooh, yum. And I got. And I got. That King Air just landed here at Dunkerswell in this total clag. I wonder why. Maybe it's an emergency landing, like a weather emergency or something. Who knows? Baby at the wheel. <laughs> Always takes longer than you think, doesn't it? Progress update. We got the canard mounts off. What's in here? <laughs> got really got very little achieved today. <laughs> All this wing's back on and the wing tips back on and the bulbs are tested. So that left wing is now complete. Uh, I'm about to start trying to get the interior back in, starting with the bastard job. Who are you talking to? The camera. Just filming. The bastard job of getting the carpet in under the seat. Don't film from that angle. <laughs> Doing the hardest bit first, and I'm going to go and try to do the other side. But um, we haven't. We've got about half what I wanted to get done today done. I'm not going to get home for another live stream. But we have actually a lot. A lot's been done, just not as much as I hoped. Keep cracking on.